हे एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू दी चैनल टूडेज वीडियो इज गोल्ड माइन फॉर एनी वन हु आर लुकिंग टू मॉनिटाइज देअर ब्लॉगर ब्लॉग इफेक्टिवली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू एक्सप्लोर फोर पावरफुल प्लेटफॉर्म विच विल इनेबल अस टू मॉनिटाइज अवर ब्लॉग सच एज एडसेंस मीडिया डॉट नेट इन्फोलिंक्स एंड इजॉय इफ यू आर एक्साइटेड अबाउट बूस्टिंग यूर ब्लॉगिंग रिवेन्यू hit that subscribe button and let's get started with our first platform first we have google adsense if you are a blogger chances are you have consider or already used adsense it is google's ad platform and it is where many bloggers begin their monetization journey now let's see some eligibility criteria of adsense to get started with adsense you will need a blogger blog with quality content and it should be compliance with google's policy apart from that there are some pages that should be included in your blog such as privacy policy terms and conditions disclaimer contact form and about your page so these are the pages should be included in your blog so this is the basic criteria for adsense to get your blog approved Now let's see some pros and cons of AdSense. In pros, we have AdSense offer us to vast network of advertisers, diverse ad format, and it is very very relatively easy to integrate ads with our blogger platform. In cons, we have a strict policy of AdSense, and our earnings can be impacted by fluctuation in advertisers' demand and Google. specifically doesn't offer any particular support to adsense if your account get disable or deactivate for any reason you will not be able to activate the account so uh, this is the most crucial part of the google adsense this is all about the google adsense now moving on to the next we have media.net a contextual ad network that power the Yahoo Bing network it is an excellent choice for those who seeking alternative to AdSense let's see some eligibility criteria to qualify for media.net your blog should have high quality english language content and it's often preferred to have significant traffic from the united state canada or the united kingdom but it is not necessary now let's talk about some pros and cons media.net is known for its responsive support and often provides higher prms making it an attractive option for blogger in specific niches however the approval process can take longer and the returns may not be as high for some niches website so this is all about the second part platform which is media.net Now let's talk about our third platform an in-text advertising platform that transfers word into ad links within our content it is great option for bloggers who are looking for a less intrusive monetization strategy so now let's talk about some eligibility criteria for info links so info links is generally accessible to most website and doesn't require a minimum traffic threshold so if you are starter or uh, you have a old blog you can still apply to info links and they have quick review teams within 48 hours you, you will get reply from their team now let's talk about some pros and cons info links provide a unique approach with in text ad making it less disruptive to user experience it is easy to integrate and has minimal learning curve however earning may be vary and some users find intex ad disruptive to the reading experience so this is the basic cons of the info links and this is all about the info links now let's talk about the last but not least isoic an ai driven platform designed to optimize and placement for maximum revenue if you are looking to take your monetization to the next level is how it might be the game changer for you now let's talk about some 
eligibility criteria for Ezoic is often for most of the all websites with decent traffic volume. It's particularly effective for those who are looking to optimize ad placement using machine learning. Let's talk about some pros and cons of Ezoic. Ezoic's AI algorithm can lead to higher revenue by optimizing an ad placement based on user behavior. It can also provide detailed analytics to help us understand our audience in a more better way. However, the setup can be more involved compared to similar ad networks and it might take some time for the AI to find the tuned placement for our blog. So this is all about the fourth platform which is Ezoic. So there you have it, a comprehensive guide to monetizing your blogger blog with AdSense, Media.net, Infolink and Ezoic. Remember the right choice depends on your blog's niche traffic and your personal preferences. If you found this information valuable, make sure you like this video, subscribe for more content and drop your questions in the comment below. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you on the next. Thank you.